what you get out of doing an exchange is you just can't compare it to anything because that you're in a family, they want to show you things, they want to make sure that you get the right image of, you know, of France and um, try all the things that you could try which make France a beautiful country and stuff like that. Whereas if you travel, you know, it's difficult to, you know, get a real grasp of what the French people are like because all you see is the tourist side of things. My host sister was 22 and she lived in Canada and my host brother was 28 and lived in Japan. And when I first um, heard that I didn't have any host brothers or sisters, I kind of freaked out. But it was all fine because um, school was basically, you know, the start of making friends and everything and then after that it was really easy. Going to school is like being introduced to, um, you know, 1300 French people on the same day. I went to the local high school, which was about 15 minutes walk from my house. Almost every street in my village was cobbled and it was just really old. There was a chateau in my village. It had been used by Louis XVI and Marie Antoinette. In the middle of my exchange, we had the opportunity to spend a week um, in uh, Côte d'Azur, Monaco, Nice, Cannes, and that was just you know, a really great opportunity to see the rest of France. And we drove into Paris and we went to the Louvre and we went to um, all the gardens around the Louvre and we studied art and we saw a film, a French film that they were all going on about. And then we went and saw an, um, like an actual show and it was all in French and it was in this tiny cramped theatre and there was just an atmosphere. It was just, just in a day that was like a representation of culture. It was all squashed in and you couldn't you know, move. There was just too much going on and it was just, it was just fantastic that day. Um, so I had four years of French before I went over there and I got there and I was like, yeah, my French will be okay, you know, four years. And I just realised that I didn't speak French at all. You have to keep trying, otherwise you're just not going to get anywhere with it. It'll all come together at the end and I, my last night in France I dreamt in French. That was kind of the pinnacle.